In this video we're going to find the yield moment using our approximate k value that we have derived um, previously. Um, so the first thing that we need is um, our rho and our n, which is our modular ratio. Um, so if we remember our n is just equal to our steel modulus divided by our concrete modulus. So our steel modulus in our case is 29,000 KSI and our concrete modulus for uh, 4,000 PSI concrete. So we'll use uh, EC equals 57,000 square root of F prime C uh, where our F prime C is in units of PSI. Uh, we'll get 3,600 KSI for our 4KSI concrete. Um, so this will give us a modular ratio of 8.1. So then we can plug these values in for K. And we'll get square root of, let's see brackets, of 8.1 times 0. 0.0112 squared minus 2 times 8.1 times 0 0.0112 and then all of this minus 8.1 times 0 0.0112 and we'll get our k to equal 0 0.3426. So this is the value that we can use for our k. Um, so now we can find our compression block depth. So if we'll remember, we'll, we'll assume in our linear approximation that we have a uh, a linear stress distribution as well. So we have a depth of KD here and a stress of FC. So um, and then let's say we have from the center to center we'll have a distance of D minus uh, KD over 3. Okay, so now we can find our KD. And our KD is just equal to our K. 0.3426 times our D. 17.63. And this will give us a value of 6.0. So using this value we can then find our moment. So our yield moment will just be equal to our AS 3 number 8 bars times 60 KSI our yield strength times our D which is 17.63 minus our KD 6.04 divided by 3. And this will give us a value of 2,221 kip inches. And then we can find our yield curvature as well. And our yield curvature is just going to be our yield strain, 0 0.0021, divided by D, 17.63, minus KD, 6.04. And this will give us a yield curvature of 1.79. 10 to the negative fourth 
radians per inch. And this gives us our approximate yield moment and our approximate yield curvature. And we can compare these uh, to our more exact values using the um, actual curve and they'll be very, very close.